Zero Accounting makes bookkeeping easy for you with its various features from simplifying complicated accounting tasks to generating useful insights into your business's finances. So, which are the best features of Zero Accounting for small business success? And stay until the end for a bonus tip for you. If we are just meeting, I'm Sharon Tay from Nuts Accounting and I'm a Zero Certified Advisor. First, let's talk about how Zero Accounting helps small businesses to be successful. When you record your financial transactions to Zero Accounting, it will then produce useful financial reports that you can use to make smart strategic decisions for your business. By making the right decisions for your business, you will then grow your business faster, make more money and grow your team. So the first three features of Zero Accounting that I will cover today will be focusing on reports. Number one, reports. Zero Accounting has prepared numerous useful financial reports for you so you can easily generate reports with a click of a button. You will find the usual financial reports such as the balance sheet report, profit and loss report, and trial balance report in Zero Accounting. On top of that, Zero also prepared some of the less common reports but some people will need these reports such as budget variance report, income and expense by contact report, and realized gains and losses report. And if you can't find what you need from the long list of reports provided by Zero, you can easily create your own custom report. Number two, Zero Analytics and Zero Analytics Plus. Zero Accounting knows reports are important to us and we don't have the time to pull the figures from multiple reports. If you want to know what is the balance of your loan, you will go to the balance sheet report. And if you want to know how much profit you made last month, you will go to the profit and loss report. Even though reports are easy to generate in Zero, you will still need to do it one by one. That's why Zero created Zero Analytics where it will compile all the information you need in one page. And best of all, this is free and it's included in your Zero subscription. Zero Analytics Business Snapshot is a business health dashboard showing key financial metrics and visual trends. Your most important financial information will be presented in charts, graphs, and colored arrows to make it easier to understand and visually show trends. Next is Zero Analytics Short Term Cash Flow, where Zero Accounting will project your future cash flow based on your invoices and bills and provide suggested actions to you. This projected cash flow may be accurate if you pay your bills according to the due dates and your customers pay you according to the due dates as well. But of course, use it with caution and just refer to it as a guide. If you love Zero Analytics and would like to use the advanced version, then you may subscribe to Zero Analytics Plus for a small fee. With Zero Analytics Plus, you can do more with the basic Zero Analytics, such as customizing the date range in business snapshot and project cash flow for the next 60 or 90 days. Speaking about bookkeeping, I think you will be interested in our Master User Academy Level 1 mini course which is completely free. If you are new to bookkeeping, confused about where to start, not sure what to do with your receipts and invoices, or you're just frustrated that bookkeeping takes up a lot of your time, then this free mini course is tailor-made for you. Our step-by-step -step guidance will kickstart your bookkeeping journey and boost your confidence and skills to efficiently complete your monthly and annual accounts so that you can use the financial reports to grow your business faster. This mini course is absolutely free for you, so sign up today at nutscounting.com forward slash 400. Number 3. SST and GST Reports If you collect sales tax like SST, Sales and Service Tax for Malaysia, and GST, Goods and Services Tax for Singapore, then you would love Zero Accounting for simplifying things for you. You can set up your own custom sales tax rates and Zero will automatically calculate and record your sales tax for each of your transactions. You can prepare your sales tax submission effortlessly with Zero Accounting's sales tax report in summary and in detail and the sales tax audit report. 
If you are in Singapore, you can generate the GST F5 return and IRAS audit file from Zero Accounting. And to help you save more time, you can even submit your GST return directly from Zero to IRAS in one click. Number four, fixed assets system. One of the reasons why I love Zero Accounting so much is because Zero Accounting simplified complicated accounting tasks. And one of the complicated accounting tasks that I don't enjoy is calculating fixed assets depreciation. And the bad news is we need to do this once a month. But lucky for you and me, Zero Accounting is here to save the day. Currently, Zero Accounting is the only cloud accounting software that includes a fixed assets system. Even QuickBooks Online doesn't have this feature at the moment. This is my favorite feature of Zero Accounting, and this is why Zero Accounting stands out from the rest. And the best part is, fixed asset system is included in all Zero Accounting plans, so that means no additional charges for this. You can easily record your fixed assets to Zero Accounting, and with a few clicks, Zero will calculate the monthly depreciation amount for all of your assets. This is a feature that you definitely need if you want to do bookkeeping like an accountant. If you got value from this, click on the like button. And if you have any questions about bookkeeping or zero accounting, type it in the comments below. Now let's continue with number five, Hopdoc. If you want to save time in doing bookkeeping, then Hopdoc is the answer for you. And Hopdoc is included in all zero accounting plans. Hopdoc will help you to record your receipts and bills to zero accounting and greatly reduce the time you spend on bookkeeping. Just upload your receipt or bill to Hopdoc and it will fill in the supplier's name, amount, bill number, bill date and due date for you. All you have to do is check if it's correct and then press a button to record it to zero accounting. Oh, and the receipt or bill will be attached to your zero accounting transaction so you can easily find it during an audit. Number six, inventory. Keeping your inventory level healthy is one of the keys to your small business success. Zero accounting inventory feature is designed to simplify the tedious job of keeping track of your inventory. The inventory quantity and costs in your balance sheet report will be updated immediately when you record the purchase of the inventory items. And whenever you made a sale, the cost of the inventory will be automatically recorded in your profit and loss report without the need for a journal entry. You can easily view your real-time inventory quantity so that you can order those low in stock before it runs out. Number seven, multi-currency transactions. Recording transactions in foreign currencies require a little more work than recording in your local currency. This is because the currency exchange rate that you have used to record the transaction most likely is different from the currency exchange rate as of the date of your payment or the date of your report. We call this difference a foreign currency gain or loss. Calculating foreign currency gain or loss is one of the most time-consuming tasks in bookkeeping, but don't worry, zero accounting will do it for you. This is one of the best features of zero accounting because zero will save you time and effort on this difficult task. All you need to do is just record the foreign currency transaction and let zero accounting seamlessly calculate and record the foreign currency gain or loss for you. And here's a bonus tip for your small business success. Small business owners usually make purchases in store for things that are used by the business such as printer ink, pen, A4 paper, and so on. Remember to get the receipts when you make these purchases because the receipts are the supporting documents for your bookkeeping transactions. You need to record these business expenses in zero accounting to produce accurate financial reports. So what are the receipts that you should record? And if you run your business from home, should you record your utility bills as your business expense? I have made a video on this topic for you, which is Receipts 101, the ultimate guide for small business owners. If you click or tap on the screen, you can watch that video. If you want to watch more videos on bookkeeping and accounting tutorials, subscribe to our channel. I'll see you in the next video.